Hey guys, Donnie Marr here, EXP Realty, Memphis, Tennessee, Marr Group. And this month, or this video, we're going to chat about things to do in Memphis, Tennessee in April. So stay tuned and let's talk April in Memphis. I always say when I do these videos, that I'm blown away by how many things there are to do in Memphis that I never think about or just didn't realize they were here, whatever the case might be. April is no difference. April 2nd, the Memphis Cancer Run. It's pretty cool. It goes from 8 a.m. to 11 a.m. It's over in Shelby Farms. We all know Shelby Farms is absolutely one of the gems of the Memphis area, without a doubt. Great event to form connections, raise awareness for cancer. I think we've all been affected by it in some way. And it's organized by Zero Prostate Cancer, which is cool. Great organization, a leading national nonprofit. Obviously, their mission is to end prostate cancer. And it's on a Sunday, so you can bring friends and family and get out there and have a good time doing that. April 8th, we've got the Harlem Globetrotters. And before I talk a lot about it, I've seen the Harlem Globetrotters in person. Jump down in the comments section and let us know if you've seen them or if you took the kids and if they enjoyed it because they put on a pretty cool show, I think. It's a Saturday, 2 p.m. at the FedEx Forum. Always fun for everybody. I know I took my kids when they were little. It's very cool. I'm sure you all know this, but I'm going to state the obvious. They've got some pretty cool basketball skills. Athleticism is off the charts, and they just make it a lot of fun. So it's definitely an event that you don't want to miss in Memphis. You can get your tickets of course at Ticketmaster hopefully there will be some available that day but you never know so don't wait and the ranges go from about $25 to $200 depending on which tickets you get. Next on our list is the Grind City Comedy Show on April 10th at 7 p.m. located at B-Side Bar and get this it's every Monday I didn't know that so it's actually not just April 10th you can do multiple Mondays I personally love comedy. I don't get to go to a lot of comedy shows, but I listen to it on Sirius XM and whatnot. And I just think it's it's funny and it's always more funny in person when you can see the comedian's facial expressions and that kind of stuff. Hosted by Jack Manis. Tickets are only 10 bucks, cheap, you know, by today's standards. Uh, and it's for the local comics to be able to come out and perform. Uh, sometimes they have new material, sometimes they're revamping old material, but it's, it gives our local comics a chance to perform. I didn't even know that was happening. Uh, obviously, great date night right there, right? So make that one happen. Overton Square Crawfish Festival is April 22nd. Over in Midtown, obviously at Overton Square, since it's the Overton Square Crawfish Festival from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. You don't even have to wake up early, so that's always good. Um, they have crawfish from the Bayou Bar and Grill, amongst others, crafted beer, live music, local vendor market will be set up. It's actually free to get in. That's pretty amazing. They have April 24th, two days later as a rain date, and obviously great time to take some friends and family out there and enjoy crawfish. And being April, we just had the first day in spring happen, I think, this week. So hopefully we're going to have some awesome weather. I know it's about 70, 80 degrees today. So hopefully it'll be super nice when you go out there. Next event, what can we say? Lizzo in concert. Man, she has exploded on the scene. Uh, and, and she's so big on trying to put a positive body image out there and just spreading positivity. You know I'm a mindset guy, so I love that. April 26, 8 p.m. Uh, in Memphis at the FedEx Forum. Won Grammy this year for Record of the Year last year. Like literally, I just heard about her last year um, and she's already won a Grammy and an Emmy, right? She, she is just pretty doggone amazing. There are tickets still available at the time that we shoot this. Check out Vivid Seats for affordable tickets. Of course, you might check Ticketmaster or what have you as well, but make sure you get the Lizzo concert on your calendar in Memphis in April. Then, of course, we want to mention this to get you planning ahead of time. Uh, not in April, but coming up May 5th through 7th is the Bill Street Music Festival. I'm gonna go ahead and call it. It's gonna rain that weekend. It always rains during the Bill Street Music Festival. Don't let that stop you though because there will be tens of thousands of other people that don't let it stop them. I almost think that it happens that way just to add to the fun and to the free spirit atmosphere of it. Obviously, the Memphians look forward to it all year. Lots and lots of bands playing. You can check out the lineup on the website, Lumineers, uh, Earth, Wind and Fire, 311, Andy Grammer, The Roots, and the list just goes on and on and on and on at that one. We all know it's located at Tomley Park in downtown. 
Tickets are on sale now, ticketsonsale.com, and, and you can buy a ticket for each day, or you can even get a ticket for the entire weekend. So just a quick little list. This is only a couple of things to do in Memphis. Jump down in the comments. Let us know what you're going to be doing in Memphis in the month of April. Obviously, we always want your contribution to help other people out because there's just no way for us to keep up with everything that's going on because Memphis just has a ridiculous amount of things happening in this city. As always, like the video so that more people get to see it and then do yourself a favor, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of the content.